Hey everyone, Chandler here, and I'm late to the trend. I still wanted to do this video though because I thought it would be funny, and I decided that I wanted to start a series called Late to the Trend Kid, where I do videos of trends that have come and gone. And just comment down below if there are some videos that you would like to see me do. And I thought it would be really funny for the first video to do the reading hate comments in ASMR. Megan Tonjes made this video and it became very, very popular to make these videos and I will link a few of my favorites in the description box down below. But I wanted to make one, but I didn't have a microphone and I thought it would be extra weird if I was like super up close to my camera. So now that I have a microphone, I can actually make this video. I'm going to dive right in and delve into the dark, dark world of the Held for review YouTube comment section. We have the capacity to have specific words blacklisted. That way, if this word is in the comment, it doesn't show up in the comment feed. And I have a lot of words blacklisted, mainly uh, specific slurs, which will not be in this video. Without further ado, here we go. Hey everyone. <sighs> so what I'm going to be doing today is reading my hate comments. I have my microphone right here and my laptop in front of me and I'm going to be telling you what video it's from as well as what the comment says and just be responding to some of them. On my coming out to me romantic video which I made years ago, this comment says, oh my god you're so naive, that's how a normal relationship works. What's next, Tumblr? A group for people who are straight but only develop a romantic attraction to people with the same eye color as them. I don't think you realize that Demi romantic means you don't have any romantic attraction at all. It's not just like... It's not just like, oh, I haven't had a crush yet and I'm developing a crush. It's literally, I feel nothing at all in terms of romantic attraction, at all, even a little, to anyone ever, at all, until a super strong bond has been formed, and I mean like being friends with this person for like five years. This next comment is from my non-binary and transitioning body dysphoria video that I just recently uploaded, and this person says, I haven't been on your channel since 2015 and I was curious, are you still dating that one girl or are you completely gay? Well, welcome back. No, I'm engaged to someone now and I think I've always been completely gay. So the next comment is from my trans body positivity video. So you have a dick or what? There's nothing down there. I'm like a Ken doll. The next comment is on my non-binary and transitioning video. Just because you are androgynous and wanted broader shoulders, etc. doesn't mean you are a new gender. I'm not a new gender. I have no gender. Also, non-binary genders are new. They've always existed. It's called special snowflake syndrome, and there are only two genders. And to that I say, my friend, transgender means that your gender identity is not the same as your gender assigned at birth, and I was not assigned a gender at birth, so therefore, I am allowed to claim the language of trans and you don't get to tell me what I am or what I am not, so good discussion. My next comment is also from my trans body positivity video and it just says, so both of you are confused. You're right, we are both confused as to why you felt like it was necessary to comment on my videos. Next comment. The next comment is from my trans kid reacting to old photos video. And it says, I'm confused, lol. I thought you were a boy at birth, but is trans and gay. But this video is saying that you were a girl at birth, now you are trans into a boy and is with a boy. That's not at all what the video is saying, like at all. The next comment is from my what is gender neutral and everything video. And it just says, okay, STFU, I accept transgenders, but Fuck gender neutrals. Honestly, I don't even know what to say. My next comment is from my LGBTQ sex ed video. And it just says, two gay dudes talking about sex. Um, neither of us are gay dudes. 
but thank you. I'll take that as a compliment. The next comment um, that I received is on my What is Gender Neutral and Everything video, and it says, LMFAO. Remember when we were all little kids and wanted to pretend to be something different? You know, like a police, doctor, astronaut. I guess some people just don't grow out of it and take it to the next level. I identify as women's panties. But are you like, used women's panties? So that means I can stick my face in any chick's panties and not get in trouble. I don't think that's what that means. I think that means that you are women's panties, like already. Not that as a person you get to stick your face in women's panties. But okay, let's keep reading. And if someone doesn't like it, then I will sue them for hurting my feelings. You don't get to sue people for hurting your feelings. That's not how suing works. And also, do you really want to spend thousands of dollars when you're the one who committed a sexual assault crime? And before I end this video, I would just like to say a huge thank you to all of the Go Die comments um, and the Go Kill Yourself comments. Thank you. They just warm my heart. Uh, reading the YouTube comment section is just not complete without. I'm getting emotional. It's just not complete without a go fuck yourself comment. And I just want to, I just want to really put that out there. And I just want to thank you for, for not letting me down this time. YouTube comment section. Okay. I'm going to go now. But if you like this video, Please like and subscribe. Um, 